guys welcome back to my channel it has been it's been a month since I have filmed and you guys have no 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 idea how much I missed you guys and have missed being in front of my camera and putting makeup on and feeling like a normal human being if you guys follow me on social media then you'll know that last month it was a really really bad month for me my MS was really acting up if you don't know I have multiple sclerosis and you know I take it day by day but obviously some days are worse than others and last month I was just having a lot of attacks a lot of flare-ups so I decided that I just had to take a break to recuperate myself and to feel better so that I can come back to you so this is going to be my woman well, my, my October favorites now Mind you, since I was sick, I really didn't have a, a lot of time to play around with makeup and to like get dressed and put a full face of makeup on. But the few days that I did like get dressed up and I attempted to put makeup on my face, these are some of my go-to. So it's not a lot, but you guys know I'm, I'm very honest and I'm not just going to shove products in a video just so that I can make it longer. These are products that I genuinely use and that I genuinely love this month. So, let's get started. First, this little bad boy has been amazing. This is the, the proper name is the Too Faced Stardust Palette by Vegas Name. And this has just been like my go-to I did try to experiment a little bit with a more dark smoky eye I used this palette even the days that I just kind of threw something on my face just so that I wouldn't look so pale and so dead this is what I use and it's just been a go-to I love it love it love it love all the shades amazing then three blushes that I have been loving more so because they're just they're affordable they're natural they're just such an amazing transitional tone you know for this time of year I'm in Miami so it's still 80 something 90 something degrees every day even though we're technically in the fall season but these are just some of my go-to's that I really really love I probably mentioned these before this is the Jordana blush in blushing rose number 37 this it's just this is a beautiful beautiful blush amazing formula i love it i love it i love it i love it this is a matte blush hopefully you know you guys could see it it's a dark day the sun isn't out so we're gonna work with what we got so yeah so this is blushing rose jordana blush powders then let me put this stuff over here so I don't talk about things twice then I love these the packaging is I have it all types messed up but these are the covergirl cheekers blush yeah they're both the same thing yeah cheekers blush and this is what they look like I love these especially like for my skin tone I think that they are so beautiful all right, so here we go. Aren't they gorgeous? I love them. Um, this one is the one that I'm actually wearing right now. And this is True Plum number 185. So that's what it looks like. Let me see how they'll swatch. All right, so there it is, the one in the bottom. You see, it's been so long, I'm like, can you guys see? All right, so there it is, the one in the bottom. That's True Plum. And then this one, um, let me get a clean finger. This one is much more natural, but I love it, love it, love it. Here it is right here. And this one is called Brick Rose, number 180. All right, so those are the three blushes. Loving them. I actually, with all three of them, what I do to apply them, you see the sun is coming out, so I probably look more illuminated. Um, what I've been using is, I use a dual fiber brush, 
I used an e.l.f. like stippling brush. It's a dual fiber brush. It's fluffy. It just, it's amazing to apply just any blush. I don't know. That's just my preference. And then, let me see. My eyeballs. I have been, this is on recommendation of Miss Laura Lee. I will, I'll link her video down below. This is, well, her channel. This is like her go-to ride or die eyeliner, liquid eyeliner. This is the NYC liquid eyeliner that's it and this is in just the color black i really really like it i'm not gonna say that it's my holy grail ride or die because you guys know it's the la color um liquid eyeliner but this one is a close second i really like it this is what the brush looks like the only thing i will be very honest and say see that's what it looks like um, it's a great formula, dries great, um, it does not budge, it doesn't smear, I really like it. The only, only, only complaint that I have, and it's more of a personal preference, because, you know, I, I love me some, I love to do a great cat eye and a great little flick of the wrist, but I just think that this brush, the tip is a little bit too thick and to do, when i do my cat eye i would prefer the la color but i can still get a great cat eye out of this but if i want like something very sharp and something with more precision then i would prefer um the la color over this but overall this is still a great great eyeliner you know it's just the brush is just a little bit thick for my personal preference and now on to the lips i have been loving these products they've just like been my goal too this is the Avon glimmer sticks lip liner in mystery mauve this is what it looks like it's just an all-over amazing mauve lip liner they're creamy they stay on they don't bleed they don't pull and tug I love them and I have been pairing it with this is the NARS Satin Lip Pencil. This writing is just so tiny. This is the, the NARS Lat Latin. The NARS Satin Lip Pencil. And this is in Riku. I'm not even gonna attempt I'm not even gonna attempt to say. This is what it looks like. And let me And this is it right here I have just been loving the combination of the mystery mob lip liner and this satin pencil over it I have loved it that has really been my go-to and last but not least another lip product this is the Maybelline the elixir color sensation this is what it looks like look at that beautiful color I love the color for this time of year and this is, it'll be nice if I tell you the color. This is the color Caramel Infused 065. So that's the applicator. And there it is, right on the top. <coughs> Excuse me. Like I said, I have been loving either these three products all together or any combination of them. I have had the perfect night nudish, mauve lip. It has gone great with a more subtle eye look, a more dramatic eye look, and I have just been loving this combination this month. So yeah, that's it, you see? Not a lot this month, but like I said, things that I did show you, they are things that I have really, really been loving. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any more requests or if you want me to do a more in-depth um, tutorial or a more in-depth review on any of these products, you guys know, just link it down below and your wish is my command and I shall do it for you guys. So, I love you guys so much and I will see you guys very soon. Bye!